everybody, this is Admiral Snackbar. I am going to attempt a Let's Play on the mod Hegemonia City States. Uh, it is a fantastic mod um, for Rome Total War, the original. And I just can't say enough good things about this. It takes place right before the Persian Wars in 512 BC. And you get all these ancient Greek uh, factions, basically. You get Sparta, Athens, and Persia. Oh, it's, it, it's great. So I'm going to go ahead and jump right in and show you guys what it's about. Uh, so here we have an absurd amount of factions. Uh, and they're, they all take place in ancient Greece. Like I said, there's Sparta, the Lacedaemons, Athens, uh, Persia, get this big ass empire, uh, the Etruscans in Italy. Um, I don't... I'm, I had I thought a lot about who I was going to play with, and I was thinking maybe Thebes, the Boeotian League, uh, maybe Sparta. I'd love to, you know, be Leonidas and kick a bunch of Persians' ass. Uh, but I think I'm going to go with Athens. Um, I already played it once through as Athens, and it's, it was a lot of fun. Um, I just really want to play from the perspective of the democratic Athens. Uh... You know, that's something that's always really intrigued me. Uh, I took a class on ancient Greece, and my professor was one of like the top uh, ancient historians. I've taken him for three semesters with a class in the ancient Near East and ancient Greece, and I just finished a class with uh, about Alexander the Great. Um, so, yeah, I I, I kind of want to let this let's play flow, kind of like a a history lesson if it, if if you will. Um, I've got some of my notes in front of me, so I intend to basically narrate as I go along, because this game, this mod, really does follow a lot of historically historically accurate uh, events, and little, uh, just little details. Um, you know, you get your strategoi, strategoi, they're the generals, and you have Miltiades, you have uh, Thucydides, uh, you have a whole bunch of just various different, um, actually historically accurate generals, and that's one part that I think is really cool about this game. And also, what I think would be cool about Athens is after, you know, after the Persians evade, invade in, you know, was it, late 400s uh, BC, uh, you basically become, enter the Peloponnesian War era. So, Sparta and Corinth and the Peloponnesian League tend to or go to ally against Athens and your um, Delian League. And it throws you right into the co competition at the beginning of the game. Because you'll have these islands over here. And you have to conquer them. They're just rebel, rebel islands. And you influence them with either democracy or oligarchy. The Spartans, and I'll get into this later, but this, the Peloponnesians preferred oligarchies, which was, you know, a handful of people in power, and Athens was a democracy, where you have the voice of the people. They had um, the boule, which was 500 uh, people representing uh, their constituencies in the assembly, which would decide all matters. Uh, it's a very interesting time period, and that's what I really like about playing as Athens, is you kind of look at it from... I, I play it from the perspective of what these uh, elitist Athenians would want, and it's just something that's really... So I know I've talked for quite a bit already, but uh, I just want to really quickly show you some of the factions that you can play as. Uh, so you have... Okay, you have the Persians, um, and it's really interesting how they do it because... Of course, the Greeks have their, you know, their hoplites, and they're super strong. They script it so then their defense is an absurd amount. And then you get the Persians, who have, like, these massive amounts of peasants who are really weak and just get slaughtered against the hoplites. And it's hilarious, and I make a lot of references because I'm in Greek life here at college, and I, I have so much fun with that. Uh, so, the campaign map continues into Italy, too. So you can play as the Etruscans, uh, you know, before Rome was established. And you get to play it from this side, too. Uh, the ancient Greeks were huge on their colonies. Uh, so, it, of course, expands over here. 
uh, into the Mediterranean, the Western Mediterranean. So you have Carthage, um, Illyrians, these were, the Greeks considered these barbarian tribes, kind of like you have Mastodon over here, and Thrace, and the Illyrians were just north of Macedonia, um, kind of bordering up against this, uh, 